Hey, what is going on guys? It's your boy Swift and we finally managed to get a copy of Ultra Goku. It has been such a struggle. Um, I've summoned probably close to 30k CC and you know, I'm just finally happy I got a copy. Toshi decided to bless me and you know, I'm just, I'm just grateful I was able to get a single copy. You know, if I can get future copies in the future, great. If not, whatever. Um, but yeah, this is the team that I want to throw them on. Obviously, I want to use them on God Key first, um, and then I'll probably, you know, try some other setups for other videos. But yeah, uh, this is the setup. I just want to let you guys know I have not played with him at all. I have no experience with his gauge. Um, I have studied his kit pretty well. I think I know everything he does. Uh, I just, I'm predicting that it's going to take me a little bit to really get used to his gauge and really master it because I know, like, you know, the timing on the gauge and getting your vanish back and drawing the green cards and stuff like that. There's actually a lot of like different strategies you can, you know, use it for. Um, so I, you know, it'll probably take me a second to get used to that. But yeah, without further ado, let's jump in. All right, first match, keep in the back of your mind, it is pretty early in the season. Although I have been getting a lot of sweaty matches. Um, I guess with the updated matchmaking system at Battle Rank 50. Uh, what, <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, okay, like I said, I, I have to get used to this gauge. Um, that was <laughs> I was charging way too long right there. Because I know you get the vantage back when it when the gauge fills up, but you know you don't want to do what I just did. There's probably certain certain times to charge and certain times not to charge, so I definitely got to get used to it. Ah, that's unfortunate. But yeah, believe it or not, I got him on the free step, the same as Ultra Gogeta. Um, it's kind of crazy. I literally pulled my only copy of both of the premium ultras on the free step. So, it's kind of crazy. Alright, let me cancel, let me cancel. Ooh, that worked out perfectly. I'll take it. Let's just go into Goku. Okay, so my gauge is almost full. I almost want to save that for when I actually need to get my Vanish back, right? I feel like that's one way to do it. Or I could just charge right now and draw the green. See, got the vanish back. I think that's a good way of doing it, is like getting the gauge almost full and then kind of waiting until you need to get your vanish back and taking advantage of it that way. Um, and I can probably get my vanish back right now as well. Nice. Ah, that's unfortunate. Oh, is he not going to rush right there? I was expecting him to use his rush, but I guess I'll go into Vados. Oh, there's the rush. Yeah, I think that about wraps it up for this game. I just want to see the damage from Kaioken Goku here. Really good damage, honestly. And once again, I'm saving that gauge for when I need to get my Vanish back. Let's hit him with this. I don't think this is going to kill. So basically, I can Vanish whatever he does. I can quickly charge and just immediately get my Vanish back. So let's charge. Nice. Oh, I heard that sidestep, my guy. That's going to be game. Yeah, this was literally the first match I've played with him, so, like I said, it's going to take me a while to get used to that gauge, but I'm definitely excited to practice. Okay, we got another God Key team. Man, I love seeing all these God Key teams. Like, I actually really love it. Because, you know, it just feels like it's been a minute since God Key's even been on the radar um, in the meta, and, you know, now we're seeing them all over the place, which is really, really cool. Okay. I feel like that's a strategy right there where you can just start off the match with a tackle. It's almost the same thing as like Fat Boo sealing your strike cards and people used to start off the match with tackles with Fat Boo. But obviously it's risky. Um, it's not something I want to do every single time. But definitely a, a tool that you can use. Alright, I got my gauge almost full. Let's charge, get the vanish back. Oh, no. okay. Very well played on his part. Um, he probably knew I was trying to charge right there. Nice. 
Let me see if I can sneak into Kaioken Goku and hit him with the blue. Oh, he swapped out. Ooh, I'll take that, though. Let's uh, charge up a little bit. Oh, he's going to give me evolution? I guess he was hoping to get me with the cover change, but I'll take it. I don't think I'm going to be able to charge up fully in time. Why is it? Dude, it wouldn't let me charge for a second. That's so weird. I need to get the timing of the charging down, because sometimes I'm, like, holding the screen, and it won't even charge. So I need to... I definitely need to practice with that. Nah, 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 my guy. Alright, let's go back to Kaioken. And I'm assuming he's going to swap out here and save Blue Boys. So I, I could just pop the ultimate, but I'm actually going to drop combo. This is a drop combo. I'm going to hit him with a strut. Oh, he didn't even swap out right there. I was expecting him to. Uh-oh. This is not good. No, that's not good. He's going to lock me in. Oh, maybe not. He's not going to lock me in. Okay. Ah, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's go to Vados, destroy his ultimate. Oh, wait, he switched to Vegeta. What? Oh, okay. Yeah, I was going to say, I thought that was maybe an accident. Uh, but GG's. All right, we got God Key versus God Key. We're both starting with Goku. So both of our strike cards are going to be sealed. Please don't have a blue. No, bad time to charge. Very bad time to charge. Okay, I should gain priority here. Let's just keep going. We got the card draw speed. Might as well gather up a couple Dragon Balls. I'm going to drop combo here. Oh, he just was not going to swap out. He's still not going to swap out. Oh, I didn't mean to tap! That's been happening a lot recently where I'm, I'm trying to, like, sidestep or something and it registers as a, as a tap attack. Ah, that's... I was hoping to get him on the cover change, but... Oh, he's going to pop his ultimate? Okay. That's not going to kill me. It's going to do a lot of damage, but it's not going to kill me. Maybe I got a little bit too greedy trying to catch him with Blue Boy's cover change, but oh well. It almost kills me. Alright, let me focus up. This is not a good start for me at all. Okay, got him with the tackle. That's actually huge. It was risky, but it paid off. Alright, let's charge up a little bit. Build up that gauge. Alright, I'm right where I want to be, where my gauge is almost full. Okay, let's vanish, get the gauge back. Or get the vanish back, I mean. No! Ah, he's just gonna lock me in. I don't think it's gonna kill me, though. Yeah, th there's no way this kills, right? It's a lot of damage, though. Ah, he sidesteps right there. Dude, this is not a good start for me at all. Let's just YOLO pop the blue, I hope it connects. Oh, that's actually huge. Don't have to worry about his rush anymore. That's exactly what I needed to turn this match around. That was a little uh, reckless of me right there, but oh well. Got rid of his rush, that's the, that's the good part. Alright, let's go into Vados. Still got her main ability. Ah, dude, I, I hate having a handful of blast cards. That's like the main downside of running a bunch of blast units, in my opinion. Oh, I will take that, though. That was kind of risky, but I'll take it. Normally, normally I don't rush in situations like those, but drastic times call for drastic measures, right? And I do need to pop Vados' main ability after this. Need to get that healing. Alright, I'm gonna just go right away. Okay. I'm assuming he's gonna save. Ah, oh, 
dude. I always forget about the strike lock, like literally. I, I need to start remembering that. Oh, this is not good. He's gonna he's gonna catch me here. But I think I should be able to soak up some damage. Especially we got the type advantage. Oh, that's huge. Pretty sure he's just dead. This is gonna one shot him. And I got my vanish back. Yep, he's dead, and I got my Vanish. Oh, he might catch me here, maybe. Okay, got a Clash. Let me try and win this. Oh, oh, dude, I'm sorry. I've been there so many times. That's literally happened to me like three or four times today already. Um, but this, it, the, I don't know why it's doing that. I think it's something with the game. This is actually another setup that I want to try. Uh, is Ultra Goku on Fusions. I've been seeing a lot of people run this setup where you just throw Ultra Goku in the leader slot on fusions. I'm contemplating just going for a tackle. I think I'm going to do it. Nice. Ah, uh, okay. He's playing, like, super aggressively. Okay. I had a feeling I should have dropped combo. I just didn't want to risk it. Ouch. That hurts. Once I can switch my... Ooh, nice. I'll take that. Uh, let's get the Vanish back here. Once I can switch my Blue Boys to Vegeta, I'll be fine. Because I'll hold type advantage over... Oh, no! Dude, he really has a rush already? What? We're like 20 counts into the match, dude. That is such a fast rush. Okay, I got lucky. I mean, I'll take it. I'm not I'm not going to complain, but that, I just was not expecting him to have a rush right there. All right, I'm going to just be safe and tap attack here. Should give me enough time to swap out. tap attack this time. I'm not going to sidestep again. Ooh, got him here. Like I said, this guy's playing super aggressively. Um, if this goes through, nice. If not, it'll make it kind of an even match. Okay, he guesses me too. We both get our rush guess. That's fine. Makes it a somewhat even match. Man, he... God, he really likes his tap attacks. There's tap shots, I should say. I still need to switch with uh, blue boys. I need to make that a high priority. That's fine. That's fine. Vados can tank that. I got the HP bench. I got uh, the the Zenkai buffer for Vados. We, we can tank this. Nice, I will take it. This is a good priority right here. Oh, he's gonna give me Ultra Goku. Alright, I was not expecting that. Oh, that's actually huge, because he does not have time to swap out. So this will be a dead Gogeta. God, Ultra Goku's damage is, is really, really good, man. On top of everything else he does, he just has really good damage. And, you know, oh, that sucks. And, you know, maybe part of that is because he's in the boost system right now, but I I'm predicting that it's going to be another situation like Ultra Gogeta where, you know, even when he leaves the boost system, I'm sure he's still going to be a really good unit. It's pretty obvious that they, they build these, ult these premium ultras to be very, very good. Oh, that's unfortunate. Let's just YOLO pop this. Oh, I popped it too late. If I would have popped that like a second sooner, I would have had him. But yeah, it's just legends being legends, man. They, they, they you know, we've been through this before where they, they constantly drop these super busted units and it's just to get you to summon. Uh, it's It sucks, but it is what it is.
kind of an interesting setup. We got Jiren on God Key, so he's got some type of Rising Rush control. Dude, it's so weird. I, I feel like I haven't seen a Zenkai Blue Goku in PvP in so long. And I sit down to record a video, and I've, I've already matched him twice, or matched uh, somebody using him twice. Uh, it's kind of weird. Okay, we got a little bit of lag. Yeah, I just, I, I probably should have tried to gain priority right there. That was kind of dumb. Um, the only thing I really could have done was try to catch him in a sidestep. Let's pop both of these greens. Is he tackling? He is tackling. Thank you for that second sidestep, my good sir. Let's go back to Kaioken. And also another reason why Kaioken's doing really good damage on this team is, you know, obviously Vados' support. You know, you can't forget about Vados' support. But also, he's just really good. I mean, even that strike damage is not bad. I probably should be charging. Yep. Need to build up that gauge a little bit. Alright, I got the gauge right at the point to where, yep, I can get my vanish back. Oh, I lost the clash anyway. Ooh, that was a nice play right there. He knew I was going back to Vados. That was a very nice play. Now the question is, do you really want to rush Vados? I don't think you do. I don't think you really want to rush Vados. Dude, Vados is actually kind of tanking. All right, let me tap attack. There's Jiren. All right, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Okay, should be out of that. Yep. Ooh, I got lucky. I, I'm not even going to lie. I got lucky right there because he, he only single tapped. Like, he could have vanished that. I really got lucky right there. I want to get my gauge. I, oh, I didn't even mean to drop that. But that actually worked out. Because I, I, I was not expecting him to swap out right there. Um, so, this is actually really good. This is going to be a dead Kaioken. And I should be able to charge up and get my Vanish back right after this. Let me charge, thank you. Oh, he is... dead? Ah, that's unfortunate, but that's fine. YOLO. Alright, and I think that about wraps it up for this game. Or actually... Almost. I didn't want to rush right there, I don't want to give him endurance. That's fine, got rid of his Vanish. Yeah, there's really no point in rushing this Jiren. I'd rather just kill him without uh, giving him Endurance. I'm assuming this is a dead Vados. Oh, Vados? Oh, never mind. She actually she actually tanked that really well. Maybe if it was a higher star Jiren, it would have killed. I can't remember how many stars this Jiren was. Uh, but dude, Vados has actually really been impressing me in this video. But yeah, I think that'll be the last match of the video. Um, I appreciate you guys for stopping by. Definitely plan on more content around this Kaioken Goku. I'm, you know, now that I finally pulled him, I'm going to be playing with God Key a lot. And I'm also going to be trying him on other setups. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for stopping by, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.